Hey everyone, uh, this is Paul, uh, one of your bartenders at uh, Salancha. I just wanted to reach out to you guys and uh, thank you all for your support. I know I speak for all the bartenders that um, we appreciate you all just hanging in there uh, with Matt and Ashley uh, you know, while we go through this uh, quarantine and everything. But um, we just wanted to say thank you. Hello, Matt. Hello, Ashley. My name's Rob. Nice to meet you guys. I'm here broadcasting live from uh, the back, back, backyard of Slancha Public House. You might have heard of the place. Enjoying the restorative powers of Elvis juice. Just wanted to say, wish you guys were here. Wish this place was open. Uh, keep going, guys. We're going to get through this crap. But, uh, it's important, so we love you. Later. Hey guys, just want to say hi, we love y'all, waiting for this place to open back up, come on man, hang in there, if it ain't going to open up, bye guy, we'll just come and do it ourselves, we don't care, <laughs> miss you in my prayers, have fun. I've never really felt like I've had a place until I found Slancha, and I can tell you that whether it's on a Friday waiting for Dave, talking to Kelly at the end of the bar, or sneaking over during Delaney's choir practice. There's nowhere else I'd rather be. So, some of my favorite memories of Slancha are when anytime I have anyone from out of town come and visit, and that's a must-go-to place, because it's a gym, and I get to show it off as something to call our own. We miss it dearly, and we love our friends Matt and Ashley, and those wonderful people that work down there. Hope to see you guys soon. Cheers. My favorite memory at Slancha uh, is a recurring one, and it's the nights that I got to play music up there. Really, really good shows always. And then get to come downstairs and have uh, beers and uh, drinks and catch up with Matt and Ashley. Um, sometimes get Taco Bell and stay up uh, to the wee hours of the morning. But I look forward to seeing you guys real soon. Hope you take care. Um, and again, love you guys and look forward to coming back to Georgetown to see you real soon. Cheers. Hey, now we're on. Hey. Hi, Matt and Ashley. We just wanted to tell you guys we miss you guys and we miss Slauncha, and it's hard drinking alone at home. So. But we got company. But we got company, and we hope to see you guys in just a few weeks when Slauncha reopens. So we'll Slauncha. see you in a few. Slauncha. And we miss you. And we miss you. And we miss everybody we there. We miss everybody. Yeah. And we'll see you soon. Oh. Cheers. My favorite thing about the pub is getting to be behind the bar. I love getting to hang out with our regulars and getting to meet new people and helping people learn about different beers that we serve. I love talking about the live music that we have and just sharing a piece of Georgetown's community with everybody. Hey, Matt and Ashley, how are y'all? Um, hey, I just wanted to do a little short message to you all and tell you how much we, uh, we appreciate you and how much I appreciate you. Um, I always enjoy going there. It's always a good time. It's got a nice feel to the place. I like taking people like my relatives or maybe people from work um, to drop in there and have a beverage and everybody always likes it and thinks it's got a great vibe to it, which it does. And uh, we really appreciate what you all have done and and uh, you, we can tell you, you all have a good heart and your heart is in it and uh, uh, I really uh, think the world of both of you. Uh, and uh, hopefully we can just keep things going a little bit longer and before long, uh, we'll have a drink. All right, y'all take care. What I miss the most about the pub is sitting there with Joe and Rob making stupid jokes while we sit there too long and drink delicious cold Guinness. And I hope Matt and Ashley know that 
as soon as everybody is able, the pub will be full and we will be back to support them. Hey, Matt and Ashley. Hey guys. We miss you. Very much. Don't worry, we're still practicing our drinking habits even though the pub's closed. We just don't get to see your faces. We're ready to get back. We just wanted to say hi. Now we hope you're doing well. Uh, we miss the pub. We miss all the regulars. We miss seeing you guys. It's, it's sad. I've heard so many people say, you know, how much of a home it is and they can't wait to get back and there's our dog barking. <laughs> Um, we'll see you soon. We're ready to get back. Yeah, Matt, Matt, I know you miss Scott more than me. It's unfortunate. But, um, <laughs> well, hang in there, guys. You have so much love and support, and we'll back you 100% with whatever you need. We just wanted to say hi and that we love you. Pub misses you. Everyone misses you, and we'll see you soon. Mwah. Bye. So I started going to the pub about six months after it opened. I was new to Georgetown. It was a really nice place to feel comforted in a new town. Um, I fell in love with the atmosphere and the people there. Haley started working there and it was perfect. It was like my favorite place and my favorite person, Unite. Um, I feel really optimistic about the future of the pub and I can't wait to get back there. Hey, Matt and Ashley. Uh... <laughs> And we would like to tell you about our favorite memory of the pub. What is it? <laughs> Top four I forgot, so the one I do remember Not was our four. first date. Yeah, that was number one, really. But we did have our first date, and that was probably when? Like the first month? First month they opened. That you guys were open. And I went in... Well, I, I met him there because, you know, I was like, I don't know about this guy. He's not picking me up. So anyway, we met there and I went in and sat at the end of the bar and I was immediately comfortable and it was just awesome. And then he walked through the door and it was life changing <laughs> for so many reasons. But we've been there ever since. Right? Yes. Please like and subscribe. Paul said the best video gets a key and the alarm code. Key and the alarm code. But no. Anyway, we love it. We love you guys. We support you 100% and um, can't wait to get in there. And, and another good thing is uh, all the friends that we've met. And... Especially Rob Jordan. <laughs> My life wouldn't have been complete without meeting Rob Jordan. It's No, it's everybody. We do love Rob. But, um, anyway, we wish you the best and we can't wait to see you. Hey, Matt and Ashley, it's Sam. As you can see, I'm bumming right now. <laughs> Quarantine life is not the life for me. I'm not wearing makeup these days. My hair is just a total mess. That's why I got this hat on. Um, anyways, I just wanted you all to know that I miss you guys so much, and please let us know whatever we can do to help you guys out. We are there to support you. Um, we miss you guys. We miss the pub. We miss seeing all our friends there. We miss having somewhere to go on a Friday night when there's nothing to do. We need to see you guys over a bar top soon. Uh, we're planning to buy you all a beer here shortly. And um, if we run out of rum or whiskey, could we just like give you guys a call? And um, that's okay, right? We could just buy from your. <laughs> <laughs> buy from your stock right just let us know anything we can do to support you guys we're doing a lot of drinking these days um so please help us out there <laughs> i hope you guys are doing well quarantine life is making us crazy as you can see <laughs> and doesn't jamie look good in pink <laughs> all right well love you guys I hope you have a great night, and please let us know. Reach out to us if there's anything we can do to help you guys. We'd love to help out and support you all. Love you all, miss you all, and hopefully see you all soon. Bye. Hey, Matt and Ashley. I just want to let you know that uh, me and Samantha miss you and uh, miss all our friends from the pub. Um, since we can't get together, I figured we could talk about some fun times. Um, one of my favorite times with you, uh, Matt, was that uh, softball game we played. Uh, you called me one day and was like, hey, man. We need a we need a, a ninth person to play this softball game. I hadn't played softball in years. I figured it'd be pretty bad. 
Uh, we had a good time. We ended up getting the win. Went back to the pub, celebrated. It was a, it was a great night. Um, pretty much any time we hung out at the pub and had a few beers, well, it was always a good time. Um, it's just always nice to hang out. Um, uh, I always want to thank you, too, for how nice you were to the fire department. You've always been so great to us and uh, letting us come down there and have meetings and uh, get together and uh, letting us um, hold birthday celebrations and uh, our 9-11 celebration down there and putting our, uh, some pictures we, we wanted you to put up on the wall. You've always been so supportive and great. Um, but my favorite time at the pub is always St. Patrick's Day. Now, as you know, that's my birthday, and uh, you've always uh, went out of your way to help Samantha make it a special day for me. Uh, the best one, though, was my 40th, um, and uh, if you want to see how fun it is for uh, other visitors, you can just look at the pictures on the wall. Um, you got pictures of Samantha on the bar, we got pictures of the cake, uh, uh, me wearing St. Patrick's Day regalia. It was just a all-around great time. And it couldn't have been, it would have been possible without you all and uh, and how supportive you were and, and just how great you've always been. Um, we miss you all and we wish you the best. Hang in there. I know it's tough right now, but, uh, you know, we'll all get through it. Uh, we miss you and love you. Salute.